did you find uh, any difficulty in getting this film made? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, Tom McCarthy wrote the script about three years ago um, for three actors, Bobby Cannavale, Patricia Clarkson, and myself. Um, so we had been, I'd been, never been on a project that early on, the film project that early on in development. So we sort of firsthand saw the, 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 the grueling process of trying to get funding. I mean, this is such an independent film. It's a very simple story. The main character is a lonely dwarf. Are, are you going to give us a couple million dollars for that? I mean, it's, people are very, you know, we're very careful. And they were sort of saying, like, you know, I don't know, you know, but... Um, it just, uh, we, we, at times, uh, I mean, we were really determined to get this movie shot and made, but there were times that, you know, you know the dark clouds were, were, yeah. were hanging over us. Um, it's about, it's a simple story, a simple, uh, it's about the need to connect, it's about loneliness. Everybody's experienced loneliness at one point or another, um, whether they know it or not, you know. Um, I think my character doesn't even know he's lonely at the beginning of the film until he finds these other people. Sort of, it's sort of like the first time you fall in love. You're sort of like you're going along in life and everything is fine, and then you go, "Oh, that's what life is all about." Wow, what have I been doing all along here? That's that's it. You know, it, it's 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 that, and, and it, it's a simple. I keep saying simple. It's uh, <laughs> it's it's the basic need to connect with with people. I think we're we're social creatures, people and uh, we need to connect. He, again, he's sort of just, just very comfortable in, in this path he's taken. He's chosen to isolate himself from others. He's sort of disappointed by, by people um, because of how, you know, they're walking down the street, ridic being ridiculed or, or, or whatever because of his size. And, and he's, just, he's just shut himself, he's built up these walls around him, let that stuff bounce off of him. But he kind of doesn't understand that building those walls, he's also blocking out the good, you know. And uh, he realizes it when he meets these other people, you know. He, he's sort of, ah, uh, the mysterious stranger. Um, somebody new in town, I mean, you know, come, to, come arrive in town in a black suit and a suitcase and move into an abandoned railroad depot. If somebody did that in my small town growing up, I'd be a little curious myself. Um, and these characters are, and and uh, um, uh, and it's great. J J uh, Joe, amazingly played by Bobby Cannavale, is sort of like his character who doesn't take no for an answer. He's just sort of like, but I just I'm coming at you from a good place. Why are you why are you walk, running away from this? I just want to, you know, what's the big deal? Let's have some coffee. Uh, and 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 all the characters have, have sort of that curiosity about them, and they're all lonely. Everybody in this film, um, they just, they, they want to find something in their life, you know, they want to find somebody new. And I think that's what this character represents, even though, unfortunately, they pick somebody who wants to push everybody away, you know. It's, I'm, I was fortunate enough to, to work with some brilliant actors. I mean, the Bobby Cannavale, Patricia Clarkson, Michelle Williams, Raven Goodwin all the supporting act, I mean, they're just a great, we got an amazing group of actors. Um, and, and, and we were so comfortable with each other. We let the, and, and with Tom's script, we trusted Tom's script so, so much that there's, we sort of let those silences live there and, 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 and uh, we just knew, I mean, with Tom, and Tom was right there with us as an actor, because Tom is an actor himself, he knew how to be with us on this side of the camera, how to, how to talk us through scenes, if there was any confusions. Sometimes we wouldn't even have to talk about it. We'd just give each other a look and like you go, I know, I know, something's wrong, we'll fix it. You know, it, 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 there was just that sort of, uh, we're all here trying to make the best possible project. You know, um, yeah, it's, you're only as good as the actors you're working with. These, these actors just have such an incredibly, they just know how to listen. A lot of actors don't, don't, have that skill to listen. They, they sort of are all caught up in their little actor tricks and they're off in their own world and you're talking to them and you know, you can't, there's nothing here. But with these actors, they're just, you know, they're great. And they're also just incredible people. We had so much fun making this movie. I, I burned so much tape. I mean, I played this very serious sort of stoic character, but with Bobby, 
I was yeah. I was cracking up every other take, you know. Yeah. He's just it was just so much fun.